Roberto Mancini talking about those Suarez allegations. Carol playing because Suarez isn't. We all know about the independent commission that found him guilty of using the racist slur. He's out for eight games. Mm -hmm. And Mancini brought that up before the game. Unusual for a rival manager to bring up something so incendiary uh, before the game. Normally what, they're what very nice exactly? about each other. He said that Liverpool had made a mistake. And he said that maybe uh, Mancini, uh, uh, Suarez, although he doesn't think he's a racist, Maybe he should have just put his hands up and said sorry and moved on. Uh, do you support what Mancini said? No, or? because I, I spoke about this the other day and I was writing something about it. What Suarez said when he says poke, what he, the other words that he used, I know a lot of Uruguayans, they speak like that naturally to their fellow black Uruguayans. So what, what, I'm going to stop you there. No, I, no, I'm no, going to stop I, you Because, I, because I know. Stop you, no, you can stop me because I've, I've been racially abused by people. Yes. Extremely. Recently yeah. in the Europa League. But when I've been in the house just Christmas, full of Uruguayans, and they speak like that to each other. Full of Uruguayans because they, no, they're, 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 you, you were in a house Oh, no, because my other half, she's South American. So right, okay. Mexican and there's Chileans. There's a lot of us at Christmas, and they naturally speak like that. But So where he's from, it's normal to him to say poor care, what he says. But see, here's my problem with what you've just mm. said. Go on. Uh, there were two linguistic experts who who's, were in the report, James Scorer and Peter Wade. Okay. Both those guys said that in South America, it's not acceptable. parts of Uruguay where it is not acceptable, it's not acceptable. and the term mm -hmm. it can be seen as offensive, it can be seen as a reference to somebody who's of a lower class, mm -hmm. it can be uh, seen as offensive towards people of darker skin. Okay. If you look like Suarez, mm -hmm. then in some cases it can be fairly affectionate in the way that he says blondie to Dirk Hout and, and, and maybe he's sort of lanky to somebody else. Mm -hmm. But if you have dark skin, mm -hmm. it can be seen as offensive. The only thing that I... He's not a racist, right? I'm not saying he's a racist. Nobody's he's made a racist right. comment, right? Yes. And I don't, go, sorry, Ronan, I really mm -hmm. don't go with in Uruguayan culture or South American culture, it's okay, because in our culture, mm -hmm. it isn't okay. Mm -hmm. it's, it's zero tolerance. Mm -hmm. And the, I'll give you one more example. I know the racism uh, is quite an in, inflammatory sort of subject. When um, Alcaraz spat at a bear, I think, of wolves, Martinez come out and said, well, in the South American and in Paraguay, it's not seemed to be as bad a thing what is over here. Mm -hmm. So, tough, over here, it seems being disgusting. Yeah, exactly. You get suspended. Exactly. And just because, it, ignorance, I don't think, is an excuse. No. He's played four years in Holland. He's mm -hmm. played in, with, mm -hmm. for Ajax. In Northern Europe, if, yes. If, and there's a, there's a clip of him as well, in, when he's in the goal mouth, mm. and he's actually touching, um, he's pinching, he's, he's pinching over, his over his arm and people mm -hmm. saying he's pinching him to wind him up. I said, no, no, I don't think he's pinching him. He's actually pointing out uh, the colour skin. of his skin. Absolutely. So if, if he's got it wrong, the thing that Liverpool got wrong and Douglas got wrong is they got the wrong context of it. Yes. Now, he, they could have come and said, in no way, we know that Suarez isn't a racist. Mm. There's a cultural difference. Sure. He didn't mean it to be offensive. Whether he did or he didn't, nobody knows. Mm. He's sorry for any offence, we're sorry for any offence, and we want to move on. By backing him unconditionally, they were so far wrong, it was frightening. And they should never in a million years have put a T-shirt on backing him before they'd read the 115-page right, report. Gonna, no I, chance. I totally agree with you. I just don't understand why he gets an eight-game ban when something is okay for him in his culture. Remember, what was the evidence against him? It was Evra's word or maybe a few of his teammates against his, he could have easily come out and said, no, I didn't say that. No, no, he didn't. He, no, 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 no sorry. I've got to uh, pull you up exactly what happened. When they pulled Suarez in, he admitted, no, he said that he called him, is it Negros? Yeah, Negros. Negros. And he, at first, he Negro, said it was... It, Negro. Yeah, Negro, Negro. He, he, he said first it was like six or seven times. Then he changed it and said, no, I only called him it once. So by admitting that it's not someone's word against the other because he's admitting yeah, no, that's that what, he called it. Yeah, so no, that's what, that's the Liverpool why I played it he's like that. Not, that's what I'm saying. If, for example, if someone racially abused me, I don't think it like, comes out outlandish and says it. They're not going to stand up and say it. The fact that he's admitted that, he's come in and said, yeah, I said this, lets me know that he thinks that's cool. Let me ask you a question. But you, you, no, so in, therefore, in, the ban, I think, is... A, a bit You've harsh. been racially abused? Yeah. Tell us when and what um, circumstances. It was about a month and a half ago, two months. We were playing against Pauk Salonika right. in Greece. Um, I was warming up. I was just going to go back into the toilet and the guys just shouted out. I don't know if I can say it on it. No, probably not on it. The N-word. So he just shouted out the N-word loud. I've seen him. I've looked up, but I didn't get mad. And I kind of, I went inside. I remember I had a banana. I don't, don't know if you ever read the article or not. No. Kind of was just uh, I, I 
I toyed with what they did because I didn't want it to get to me. Because if it got to me, I'd have just blew up. So here's a question for yeah. you. If that's a player who says that to you, why would you not want a long ban for that player? Because it's not what I, I just understand their culture a bit more. Then but does maybe that make it any less offensive? Yes, because if he if he walks around normally with his friends and says Porque Negro, and he, that's cool within their culture, and then he says to um, Evra, Porque Negro, if he says that to him, he says it to him because he, and he goes and admits it to, to, the, to the board, okay. he feels that's normal. Ban him if you may, because we see it wrong, but eight games?